What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're on Epic Seven. Um, guys, we're gonna be. Let's check this real quick. Okay, anyway, we're gonna be talking about some things today, guys. Uh, and really, my main thing I want to talk about is gonna be why aren't they giving the three stars some love, guys? I want the three stars to get some love. So let's go to the journal. I'm gonna look at the different freestyles. I mean, three star characters. I said three stars, three styles, <laughs> different three style characters that are in the game, guys. Um, let's see, can we get the buy character? Oh, all heroes. We don't go about three stars here. All right, these are all the three stars in the game. Now, some of these three stars do have spells to change. For instance, Chaos Inquisitor, Butcher Corpse Inquisitor, they have. Specialty changes, but what about some of the ones that haven't got specialty changes and since they've been in the game? Um, I haven't seen anybody break out a Juni yet. Maybe there is some videos. I might do a look at that. Azaleas haven't ever been broken out. Why don't she get a specialty change so we can finally use her? Like, maybe she's not that well of a character. Well, like, well, a character that's like. But this guy right here is just his face alone, man. Look at this dude. He's a cool character. I feel like he needs a spell to change. I, I would see him being like this cool, long mane, silverish. I don't know. There's there is a character design that could be probably done for him. You know, I think that can bring him out and be kind of cool. If I could draw guys, I would come up with some designs and pitch them for the episode. But I can't draw. <laughs> Melanie, I really think she's a cool dragon character, uh, but she's she she has some niche usage, but she needs some love. She needs some love. She needs some love. Uh, Roz, you don't count Roz. Uh, Claudia is new, so we won't count her because maybe we don't know if she might get something. She's probably not though. She's gonna be on the list with some of the other people. This girl, she's cool looking to me. When can we get specially changed new moms? Uh, I don't know. What would she be? Uh, dragon Ken? I don't know. It says something about her being a dragon knight. So, I don't know. Give her something, guys. There is there is some love to be had with these characters, I think. Godmother. I really like this character for some reason. I, I like to be in like an older um, machine lady, police lady. I like the character. She should be, um, upgraded. General Godmother or something. I don't know. Or maybe since they named her Godmother, they won't give her, um, specialty change, you know. A former police executive from Palicia. Godmother is now in charge of Vangelina Group in the unregular area. Thanks to her, why, why we can't just get like a... Whatever the name of the group is, give her that name, Godmother. I don't know. Like, I don't know. There could be a reason to give her an upgrade. We const they constantly bring new characters into the game when there's a lot of characters here that could be, like, upgraded. Hazel has one. Carrie has one. Carmen. Carmen Rose, I think she has one. Yeah, Carmen Rose has one. Hazel has one. Enoch. I mean, I know he's a meme to some people, but look at this face. He's menacing, bro. He is menacing. He's supposed to be a priest in the roles of part. Well, is he? Enoch used to be connection. Used his connection with an old to become a priest. Okay, yeah, he's a priest. But why can't he have like that kind of Clarissa? He he already not nice on his outside face. Maybe we do the opposite with him and make him actually be a nice guy. Like, he shows outwardly meanness, but he's really nice in the inside. Or he's secretly pining over someone or something. But all of his stuff, his relationship stuff on here is hostile. Hostile to Lydica, hostile to Jenna, hostile to Angelica. Why he can't have one that's, like, secretly in love with or secretly admires that person. Give him something and then make that his profile. Make that his backstory stuff, you know? Um, Lena. Like, she's OG, bro. 
Like when I started the game, she was one of the people that showed up as being a campaign farmer. That's when campaign farming was still a thing in this game. And he still can't do it, but like, there's no reason to do it. There's better ways of doing things. But why she couldn't be uh um ascended or something. Let's see, daughter of the family of sources from Witch Haven, wondering she could be freaking that muscle dude from the anime. Like driven by uh her chance her things to get stronger, she finally honed her magic to be I don't know, magic to be a fist or something. I don't know. There's something they can do here. Like there's something here. Apparently she was so this is a witch haven wandering fighting her son inside her march at her ton Tahoe. That's the one who needs an upgrade. Her ton. Did I pass him already? He needs an upgrade. Look at this dude. Why he can't be like martial artist Hatan? You know? Or Muay Thai Matan uh, Hatan. Because he, he has his knee move. Knee smash. That, that doesn't say Muay Thai. I, I don't know what. Like it could be tournament. Tournament Hatan. Tournament Hatan. Driven for his his um driven by his determination to get better Hatan started going to every martial arts tournament in Ritonia and you know around the whole continent until you know he ascended and became known as tournament Hatan or something a champion uh no we got champion Zerato I don't know contender Hatan that could be cool Maybe he, he he fought against champion Zerato and didn't succeed, but he came known as contender Hatan forever or something. That would be cool. Uh, uh, all I got to say is, y'all don't take my ideas and put them in game. Uh, <laughs> Epic 7, Smilegate. Don't take my ideas and put them in game without at least saying, hey, we liked it. And give me some kind of, um, you don't have to give me no money. I just want, like, notoriety. This is why I make stuff like this. Like, I like the, the lore of the game, the characters in the game. Some of them just need some more love. There's a way to flesh out your game without just adding new uh, Moonlight characters all the time. Bask. Does she has one? I think she has one. And if she doesn't, she needs one. Why not? Let's see. Let's, let's type her name in. Pass. Oh, excuse me. Why is it doing that? Search. Maybe not. Maybe she doesn't. Why is it just defaulting to my search now? That's weird. Okay, go back. Anyway, I don't know. Judith. I don't think she has one. This is an assassin girl. A cute, cheerful member of Ringar Public Security Club. Judith originally came to Ringar as a thief where I set up a magical artifact. She could be treasure hunter Judith or something. However, she enjoyed her time in the Public Security Club so much she eventually forgot her original goal. She is an old friend of Long Tail's company commander, Armin. Treasure Hunter Judith. That's easy. Like, come on, guys. Like, do it based off their story. Get them upgrades. Let's see who else we can we could probably do an update. Or we already have the upgrade. Gunther. Gunther has a, his own, um, in one of the, the stories, he has his own um, mercenary thing. Veteran of the Archdemon War, Gunther is often misunderstood because of his rough looking face, but he's a highly tra talented treasure hunter. He's a treasure hunter. Why we can't get, um, I don't know. 
he drops his axe and loses his armor and becomes the swashbuckling treasure hunter or something. You know, he could be a pirate Gunther or something. There's there's something to do do right there, mercenary Gunther. Um. Eaton, he could be known as the Lost Guardian. Lost Guardian Eaton. Or he's a golem, actually. But he's still, that's still like all the one reason to make him a guardian or something. I would read more into this, though, and see what I would, would change him to be. But, like, guys, you can't tell me, like, some of these ideas I'm coming up with on the spot. And these are on the spot. These are, these are cool. Like, Gloomy Rain. Banshee formed with the corrupted when she ruins, when the ruins are massed in fog, she sings a song of rumors. She could be just Banshee, gloomy rain or something, or Princess, Princess Banshee. I don't know. She could be something, bro. Like, there's a way, uh, just make her darker, dark darkness, gloomy rain, dark version of her. I don't know. That that might be a little bit. <laughs> that might not be that um, inspiring. This character right here, I like the way she looked. I know she's an escape, one of the escape experiments. But why she can't have a redeeming story too, like um, Mercedes? I like this character. This is one of the most slept on, underrated characters, just by design alone. Have escaped the homunculus experiments in the laboratory. I don't even know how to spell her name. Otilly went to the rhetoric more following her cloudy memory of her past. Her blank facial expression and lack of human emotions makes it very hard to tell if she's lying. She is quick-witted and good with conversation skills. Now, she could have something to do with vampires or something. Maybe she's a long... I think rhetoric more has to do with vampires, if I'm not mistaken. If it's not, whatever where the more has to do it, bring her into that story. I I don't know a lot of the stories in this game, first of all. So maybe I should do uh, another one of these afterwards. After I finish like going through some of the stories and like making notes of what I liked out of the story and what I think could be the way of upgrading these characters. Some of these characters need upgrades. Penelope, I think she's recently new. She's a dragon knight. I think I like her kit already, but she could be upgraded to be even better. Sutan is still new. Corrado. I mean, this dude, if this ain't, like, the coolest looking dudes. Look at the light orbs and the staff. He's one of the few guys in the game that has a staff as a weapon. One of the few. A mercenary with memories wandering in search of home. Where would his home be? Unlike his intimidating appearance, he is extremely kind, sincere. Where would his home be? Have they talked about this yet? Where am I from? A wonder mercenary who lost his memory. Oh, he lost his memory. This could be a new continent come out or something, or a new secret island or something. Island no one knows about where there's monks just... Because he looks like a monk character. Where there's monks just out there um just doing monk stuff i don't know i say doing monk stuff most time there's always a strong monk though there could be a monk that goes on a goes away from the peacefulness and decides that he's going to be not peaceful and he awakens and remembers what he's supposed to be doing and stop him or something it could be awakened Hurado. Or inner eye Horado. I don't know. There's something there, guys. There's so much this game can do. Like, story-wise. And I think it's often glossed over because what we get is new moonlight characters. That's what we get majority of the time. You know? I, mean, I don't mind the new moonlight characters. Put them in the story. But we have... A couple different versions already of some of these characters. Briar Witch Seria. No, not her. It's somebody we have a bunch of different versions of. Like, 
like, what's the point? Stallone will be in one of them. Like, there's a re we could actually like have different characters, guys, and that's what I'm saying. Even Bellion could have like a mode where she's actually a warrior or a thief or something instead of just being a tanky person on a throne. Like, what? Like, give her some more design. And I wouldn't even like do her because she's such a um, character that's being used already. Like, she might be not like the highest percentage anymore, but she's still going to be used. Majority of these characters. Anyway, guys, I feel like, oh, you know, there's a character I didn't mention. And I'm going to mention him because he helped me through Banshee the first time I did it. Um, oh, here goes some more of them, too. Like, why some of them weren't popping up earlier? Some of the characters weren't popping up early. Unless I scroll quick. I might have scrolled quick to actually see what happened. Jack. Why doesn't Jack have his own? Jack is in so many different stories. Side stories and um, split splintered stories. Like, he's a mercenary. Give him his own mercenary clan. I don't know. The mercenary of the Suen. Or something like that. He's from the Ita clan. Jack is committed to self-discipline and hopes to improve treatment of his fellow Suen by becoming a skilled and famous warrior. I don't know. Wandering Jack. I don't know. Something. He's a healer, so maybe we can change from being a healer to being more like a mage or a warrior. I don't know. He was kind of a cool character. He boosted my other characters that I used with him in Wyvern. I don't know if I did ever did it. Not a video. Not Wyvern. Banshee. I never did, ever did a video on it, but he, I used him as my one of my characters to do some damage to the wave as well as give my people speed. So that the next person cleared the wave and so on and so on. But, you know, there's a lot of characters here. I, I kind of like, I think I scrolled too quick. I, I jumped from Ian and went all the way to the bottom. Um, Ian, very cool character design. Cool glassy nerd, glasses nerd dude. I say glasses. He has little squares. I don't know if that has anything to do with his, his skills or anything. But he could be a cool character. To upgrade um Anis. i don't know what he has to do but he always has like fists and the chains and stuff fighter among the criminal underground known as Aken outlaw and is committed to committed a lot of crimes and has simple with his simple and bravado good personality he is once strong reputation for taking care of people around him but after escaping prison he became incredibly selfish so he was better in prison. That sucks. Anyway, regardless, he could be somebody's leader, maybe the ruffian leader. I don't know something. Look at this design. Very cool. Those type of characters make me want to use them, but then I realize I can't use them because they they don't do nothing. Muchacho, why don't we have somebody for him? Like, he could be somebody cool. Living a careless free as a leader of a group of thieves, he turns up a new leaf of near Cecilia. I began to earn his life a follower of Corvus. He cherishes loyalty. Pack leader muchacho or something. I don't know. That would be kind of cool. Ezra's new Orte. I like this character too. She's kind of new though. I don't think that she's like a good character to be like. If you want to, this character, this dude, he's going. He's probably if everybody has him, he's on the top of your list. If you haven't favored somebody above him, why doesn't he have a upgrade yet? Athlay, young boy with a wild dream, of becoming a legendary hero. Easy. Legendary Hero Adlai or um, um, Schoolboy Adlai. I don't know. There's something to do here. Maybe he could be Journeyman Adlai. Adventurer Adlai. 
I'm probably saying his name wrong too, but it's A D L A Y L A. That's what I see. I don't know. Um, some of these other characters are already done. Yuri Young's kind of new, but like I like her character. Marissa is new. No, she's not. She's not new. She needs to upgrade. Give her character. Give her a special shade. Let's expand the game, guys. That's all I want right now. I jumped around a lot here, but you get what I'm saying, guys. If you like the video, don't forget to like, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. This has been a long video, but this is something we can have a conversation. And tell me what your favorite character is in a game that's a three star. It don't even have to be a three star. But tell me if they if they are a three star. Tell me why you think they should get um, a special change. I'll see you in the comments.